Here's how to delete the content of a data source from your app. Let's say you have a to-do list. Once you finish the task, you want to delete it from the list. In your Figma file, make sure you add the remote action tag on the delete element. And in Bravo, we need to set up a workflow that deletes this data from the database. How to set up the request to delete data. First, go to Airtable, open the API documentation. Find your table on the left-hand side, go to delete records. Find the example request and copy the request URL. In Bravo's data library, paste it into a new request page and change the type to delete. At the end of the request URL, add the ID variable. Under parameters, put an ID, which is case sensitive, as the key. For the value, we go back to the list request that we have set up to retrieve the to-do list. Get the response list again and select the data records ID and copy the ID itself. Then select the data, change the name to ID, case sensitive. Paste the ID as the delete request parameter value. This setup allows the request to delete the data corresponding to what you've selected on the list page. Click send to test the request. You have successfully set it up if you receive a response list and the record in your data source has been deleted. In your app project, go to the page that contains the remote action element. Locate the element, under action, select the delete request. Set up a confirmation message if you like, and the response actions to configure what happens when the user presses the delete element. Test out the delete action in Bravo Vision. Thanks for watching and keep Bravo rising.